this is R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube Tech Guy. Hey guys, so today I'm going to be bringing you back a video that a lot of people have requested with the Galaxy Note 8, and that is how to bring back S-Note and Action Memo. Now, Action Memo was a fan favorite by far, uh, and Samsung has created a new app uh, called Samsung Notes, and this is a note-taking app. It does have some implementations of Action Memo. You can still hold the button down, double tap the screen, and it will quickly launch a note that you can write with and save it and immediately goes into your notes. So it is that simple and easy to do uh, just to write and then it's in your notes. And this is the same place where your um, off-screen memos go. However, Action Memo is a fan favorite because you could do more with the notes and people really liked it. So how do you get it back? Well, that's actually from a website called ABK Mirror. Uh, we'll have all three links in the description down below. But the whole idea behind this is you go to this website and this is the latest version of the original S Note app instead of Samsung Notes. Uh, and this was just updated actually in the last month. So it's very current. So once you install all of these three, you have the full original S Note style app. So it's really great. And yes, you then have Action Memo. So Action Memo, again, the reason why people liked it so much is because you can do more with it than just write. So for instance, if you write a name and number down, you can link to action. And this was a big feature that they got rid of when they brought Samsung Notes about. And that is I can immediately uh, write down a name and number and call this person or put it in context or text message them. And it fills it out perfectly. It always gets it uh, really well. Now, with that being said, it's had an updated look too, so it looks a lot nicer and cleaner than you might remember. And it has a lot of features. Again, you could search for this on the internet. So if you wrote down something and you don't know what it is, you can search for it online. You can write down an address and immediately navigate to it, or you can write down an email address and immediately email this person, or write down a grocery list and put it in your task. So this is the kind of things you could do with Action Memo and why we really grew to like it. Uh, so that is available. However, you cannot do the double tap to bring up Action Memo. So that is the one thing that you cannot do that we all loved about Action Memo is that you double tap it and it immediately comes up. That unfortunately will still uh, launch Samsung Notes. I've tried disabling Samsung Notes and seeing if that allowed you to, no luck. So the good news is you do get uh, S Note back over Samsung Notes. If you recall, I did this on another video before, but one of the reasons why I like uh, S Note more than Samsung Notes is on Samsung Notes, you cannot type and then in the same line to maybe do like a shape around it or something like that. Like I can't, you know, do a shape around this hello because that splits it up between keyboard and writing. So that is a really frustrating thing for me. I do like this feature at least that it allows you to uh, kind of make it go in the lines. But for me, I need to be able to do nicer structures. So when I can do this on S note, it looks a lot better because of this because I have this ability, which again, I don't have on Samsung Note. So now I can actually write and I can even do like a shape if I want to. So I can do things like to organize it. And uh, really, I love this. The shape recognition they should bring back. It's just, it's such a good thing to have. And yeah. All right, guys, let me know what you guys think. Are you happy about this video? If you are, please give a like, thumbs up before you leave and make sure to share it with all your friends. Thank you as always for watching. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube tech guy. Thank you for watching our video. If you liked it, why don't you go ahead and subscribe up there. Make sure you follow us on social media right here. And of course, check out our latest video up there. And right down here, you're going to find the perfect video for you. Or at least that's what YouTube tells me. Thanks again.